All right, guys, so we just finished these two right here together. And these two were, uh, they, were they were cleaned up, basically. They hadn't done anything to them all winter. <laughs> these are the two that you know that you're not doing anything to them for the winter. You know, you're going to have to do a clean up. And tell me, these, these are two customers. Uh, they're down the street from me. Uh, they're not 12 months. They're just regular season lawns but when i come and i do <laughs> the spring cleanup i don't charge them i don't charge them tell me would you charge them so yeah tell me would you charge a cleanup fee these are two just regular customers i've been doing these lawns for oh man six seven years would you charge them a cleanup fee it was just one to grow leave me a comment All right, guys, so we just finished this one. And we got two down the street we just finished. And we're going there next. So, yeah, four in a row. Duck is edge in that one. And I got to go back and get the truck. Here's the truck. This one. And we will trust our trimming bushes uh, the 1st of May. And the clients know that. <laughs> and that one there. And then when we do that last one, we're headed to the next street. Okay, guys, just finished this one. Take a look. Is that smooth or what? That's Augusta National. <laughs> and we did a pine trial install here. Yeah. And we did the pine straw install in the lawn. Uh, took us about 40 minutes. And this one is a 12 month weekly. So that was a touch up on her pine straw. So she got that as a gimme. I don't charge her for that. That's part of her package. You have any packages like that? If you do, where you make deals with your client, leave it in the comments. We're moving to the next one. All right, guys, so this property right behind me, that's a brand new one. Just got it. Corner lot. Didn't get a shot of the one down the street. One down the street, we picked it up also, and all of these, both of these are weeklies. So, uh, I think we'll have more weekly properties this year than we've ever had. Yeah, we're moving on. Got 14 on the books. We picked up two new ones that I'm going to show you. We picked them up yesterday. I'll show them to you later on. We headed that way. And, uh, yeah, we're moving on. All right, guys, Johnny with Upscale. So today, guys, last week in April, and we're stepping our bush trimming up a little bit. We usually don't start trimming bushes until the 1st of May. Tell me what you do on that. We start the first of May. When do you start? Do you just start any time? Take a look. We just took care of that big bush. And there's more to come about this. Duck is trimming that lower petalum there. He's trimmed this lower petalum. And that one in the corner. 
the crate murders, if we do those, that's, you know, that's excellent. But I'm gonna tell you what's going on here. We'll take care of those. We'll take care of that lower pepper there. And then we take care of the bushes in the front. We are starting on the back today because we're just getting started on. We'll trim these when we get back. There's a lower pelon right there on that corner. Now, here's the, 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 the click. This property is a 12 month weekly. I come here every week. They have a strict HOA. Now, I've tried to get them to do pine straw, but I don't think they're just into lawn, looking a certain kind of way they live in a subdivision with a strict HOA. So, I don't even worry about pine straw anymore, but they have to have the bushes trimmed and the lawn have to look good in this neighborhood. Now, this is what happens. I come here every week, and the trade-off is they get the bushes done. The bushes I just showed you. I come here 12 months out of the year. Would you make a trade off like that? Leave that in the comment and tell me. Let's get along here. It's what we do, guys. So now, guys, be careful when you're making agreements. Because you can easily look at these bushes and see. It's $125 or $30 worth of bush trimming of anybody's money. But here's the thing. I do the bushes at my own discretion. I do them at my own discretion. Nobody comes out and tells me, hey, you need to do the bushes. I do the bushes at my own discretion. That is the agreement. I haven't trimmed them this year. Today is the first day we have worked on bushes. We officially start next month. As we said, it's finished. All right, we're moving on. All right, guys, Johnny with Upscale, so we're talking about new properties. Guys, I got two on yesterday. And these are good ones. Take a look. This is the first one. And this, this guy called me. Said the guys that he had before were rutting up his yard. <clears throat> and he wants it push mode. So we're going to oblige him. And we're going to do that. Because he told me I could use the big mower if I thought I could mow it but if he said in the beginning that he wanted it push mode then guys always listen to your client if he brought that up then that's what he wants he wants it push mode so that's what we're going to give him take a little extra time but we're going to give him but they're paying and then we got check it out we're going to be doing these bushes and everything and this is a property that I've had my eyes on, guys. And then all of a sudden, yesterday, I got a call from this guy. And then he said, let's walk, let's walk across the street. Take a look. We got this property also. But today, we're just doing regular maintenance. And what I'm going to do with these is, when we get down to the bush trimming, I'm going to set aside a day to do that. So that we'll have time. We won't have to be in a rush. We won't have 10 properties to do. So, there you go, guys. This one here, I put a fly on that door. <laughs> Let me get to work. I'm not going to video anything, but I'll bring you back a finish.
guys. We're done with it. There's that one. And this one is just, the back has about grass about like that. And it's going to be mostly trimming at this line here. And here's the other one. And I itch all this stuff up. Edge it all the way around. Edge is dead out that stairway. And again, guys, these are the properties that I'm looking for. I don't know about you, but this is what I'm looking for. Here's the driveway going in the back. And one of his pet peeves was that the other guys rutted this yard up. Now, we pushed him out the front as you saw. But take a look at the back. There are no ruts back in. I mowed this one with the standalone brand. And it took us a hour to do through these bulbs. And these are new profits. 